Attention is pouring in following the death of Tom Ledden, who played in one of Tom Petty's earliest bands. And while he never made it as big as some of Gainesville's legends, people who knew him say he was just as talented. TV20's Ethan Badowski tells us how those who knew him are remembering their friend. Tom was what you'd call a, just a genuinely good person. Hoch Shatama grew up engulfed in the Gainesville rock scene that raised legends like Tom Petty, the Allman Brothers, and Stephen Stills. It also produced Tom Ludden, who played in both of Petty's first bands. For the people who grew up with them, it is still hard to believe how much talent this town produced. We saw the Beatles on TV. We saw the Allman Brothers around here. What we didn't realize was that Petty and, and Ledden and all these other guys were going to be the guys we would one day see on TV playing with all these, you know, all these heroes of ours. Each year since Tom Petty died, Hartwood Soundstage has hosted a Tom Petty weekend to honor his music. Shatama said he will always appreciate Tom Ludden for making the effort to appear at each one. He was one of the only, he's one of the only old musicians from Mud Crutch and the Heartbreakers and, and that old gang that, that actually made it down here to do it. Some of Ledden's longtime friends shared what they'll miss about him most. Just his smile and how what a friendly, easy guy he was. I just miss him as a person, you know. I mean, he's just a, he's a gentle soul. Messages for Tom Ludden have poured in from Tom Petty's family and fellow Mud Crutch members, including Heartbreakers guitarist Mike Campbell, who said on Instagram, Tom Ludden was my deepest guitar soul brother. A kinder soul has never walked the earth. Tom Ludden was 70 years old. In the studio, Ethan Madowski, TV20 News.